what a journey it has been. What a journey it has been for my good sis Justine. A journey it has been for Jaleb Hive, Team Jaleb, and Jaleb. What a journey. We made history last night. We had the first black Love Island couple in their franchise win the whole entire season. We did it. We did it. I'm just super happy for them. Can't wait to see what's in store for Jaleb as a couple. And it's kind of bittersweet because this is the last, this is the last review. This is the last Love Island season two upload. Oh my gosh. Team Justine Hive, how we feeling? How we feeling guys? How we feeling? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know who to speak, it's your girl Kyler B coming at you with a new video. Let's get right into this. We're going to be talking about Love Island Season 2 USA finale, which is also episode 34. So, last night's episode went by, you know, really quickly. They didn't, like, give you any fillers. It went from Sally waking everybody up to they getting a text uh, during the little brunch, se brunch session. And then the guys, you know, write their... Va write their um, um, love declarations of love the girls write their declarations of love while also finding an outfit for the night um there's just a little debacle about justine's purple dress because people thought you know the dress didn't suit her but i think when you see it on tv it actually looked really good so the dress looks really good i mean you know and she likes it so it's nothing it's nothing really to talk about um we heard laura and carrington and carrington had some way of words he had a way of words we heard uh, Johnny and Sally speak their declarations of love. Then we had Jayla. Now, you know, Justine said King Caleb. Or she said King. She said my king. She said I love you king. I was like, oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. And then Caleb's speech now. Mr. Caleb, Mr. Poet that doesn't even know it. Um, This dude had everybody tearing up. Even Carrington, a guy who barely shows his emotions like almost about to cry or already tearing up and i was like wow but his speech was super great then we had calvin and mora and calvin mr suave calvin dude bend down on his knees and he was just like everyone thought he was gonna propose he's like no and then justine and sally jumped because that, that's what they thought he was gonna like either propose to mora to be his girlfriend or whatever or something like that and you know he was just being smooth with it uh and then sally said something kind of slick she was like oh me next <laughs> it was like oh no um but yeah it was very quick the episode went by really quickly then after the declarations of love air ariel comes in so ariel comes in talks to each of the couples talk about their journey from start to finish like i said it's been a journey from queen justine been a journey for miss justine from not being anybody's pick to being, you know, something that's someone that Jeremiah has to settle for because, you know, he didn't get to have Sally when he picked her, you know, to finding Caleb and, you know, making that bold move in the car wash and talking to him, being, you know, vulnerable with him, got her to this point. It's been a journey. I remember day one, episode one, I was just like, they're treating Justine dirty, like, really no not none of the guys were even talking to her i'm like i don't see any clip of any of the guys socializing with justine i was just like wow this is so upsetting i was just like okay and then johnny comes in and then he wasn't even looking justine's way he was just like caitlin or sally and i'm just like wow so i'm just like i'm just so ecstatic for them like you guys should see my reaction i did actually recorded a live reaction of me hearing the news i was trying to do a whole lot um live reaction of me watching the whole entire episode but some stuff messed up so i only got to my reaction which is really the only part that you should really care about is the reaction of who won the season which is kind of funny because the way ooh, you just gotta see it
So, anyway, Justine and Caleb won. They won. Uh, I've been riding for Justine day one. You know, I've been behind every decision she made in that villa. You know, even behind her kissing Caleb. I was just like, I was just shocked. But I was like, yes. And then when she told, you know, Rachel how she felt in the confessional. And she told, she was like, yes, Justine, tell her say it louder okay um so i'm just so happy for my girl justine man um it's just it's just really such a you know great thing to see um you know i've been doing reviews and commentary all this month daily reviews uploads i've been putting that work the way that i'm like so was so invested in the show it was just like oh snap like watching the show every night of the week you know being invested in justine's journey and seeing how it unfolds it was just so great to see now it's coming to an end so it's kind of bittersweet but you know here we are um if you guys want to see how i felt you know i have from you know previously i have a whole playlist of love island season two reviews so you guys can check those out I also do other commentary reviews as well, so you guys can check those out. You know, they're all in my, you know, on my channel, so you guys can check those out too. If you have any other shows you guys want me to see and talk about, you guys can link them, you know, comment them down below. Let me know what you guys want me to, see, like, watch next and talk about. So, but it's been a bittersweet journey. I appreciate all the subscribers that I have, you know, gained from this experience. All the um, comments and people just commenting and supporting me on this channel. I appreciate it all. I'm really trying to get in touch and try to have an interview with Justine Caleb or Sally. Those are my top three for, sh for sure. I mean, if I can get any of the other finalists, um, definitely would interview them as well i just have like a couple questions you know and hopefully you guys can give me some of your questions to ask them so i would definitely if that's you know if that happens for me uh definitely you know do use your questions for the interview that i may have um anyway guys i don't know we won we did it you know, it's been a journey for us. Hopefully, hopefully you guys who has been around, stay around because we have more to come. More to come. Definitely when Love Island Season 3 comes on, definitely we'll do that. I don't know if they, the franchise will be doing um, the same method of showing the episodes every night of the week or going back to the five days a week method. But it was very much a great journey. And... If you guys like the video, like the video, comment down below. Let me know your thoughts, comments, and concerns once again. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, subscribe. Help your girl. Help me out. Okay? And thank you guys for watching this video. Peace.